Starting today, Nikon is releasing the third major firmware update for the flagship Z9. Firmware 4.0 is here, and you won't believe what your Z9 can do now. For the first time in a Nikon camera, a feature called Auto Capture is enabled. In the past, camera operators who position remote cameras still had to physically trigger them. This meant a lot of guesswork. Without being behind the camera and looking through the viewfinder, photographers would have to approximate when their subject was in the frame. But not anymore. With firmware 4.0, the Z9 can be programmed to trigger at the point when it detects movement across the frame and in a direction that you specify. Imagine a downhill skier coming around a turn and the Z9 firing up to 120 frames per second while they cross the frame. Or you can program auto capture to trigger the shutter the moment the subject enters a designated distance. Imagine capturing remote images of a subject coming towards the camera and liberating yourself to capture panning shots from another angle. And finally, using the most sophisticated subject detection system, auto capture can trigger the Z9 to release when it detects people, animals, or vehicles within the frame. You can even merge any or all three of these criteria with one another, as well as save custom user presets in the auto capture menu for quick recall. Now you can place the camera in an inconvenient or impossible position while having the assurance that the camera will react all on its own when the time is right. Users shooting in N-Log will get a huge improvement in their workflow as they can now choose ISO settings down to as low as low 2.0, which approximates the exposure value of ISO 200. This improves shadow details by shifting the dynamic range towards the darker parts of the frame. This also liberates shooters who normally film during the day or brighter conditions from using ND filters. Other video enhancements include new built-in slow motion, in-camera, in full HD, more high-res zoom speeds, now 11 in total, for more control of the look of your video. And in the stills department, pre-release capture can now be activated for up to 300 seconds prior to release, perfect for photographers shooting lightning strikes. 3D tracking has been enhanced with better tracking for small erratic subjects, as well as a red focus point for higher contrast in bright conditions. Finer bracketing increments. Improved meter accuracy during interval timer shooting. 13 new customizable buttons for stills, video, and playback. Numeric display of focus distance on the camera for compatible lenses. The return of exposure delay mode. Support for NX Mobile Air that allows you to share camera settings through the app rather than having to save them to a memory card. And my personal favorite, four new custom shutter sounds, including a simple tone, DSLR, film, and rangefinder. Things just keep getting more exciting for users of the Z9 with constant updates that not only improve existing features, but have the potential of revolutionizing content capture entirely. You can download the firmware update from our website today, but remember, you don't even need a computer. You can do it all with your phone using our SnapBridge app. Stay up to date with Nikon USA by subscribing to our channel and let us know in the comment section which feature you're most excited about.